Yeehaw! Trump for president, boy! We at the um, American Loggers Association are very happy and proud to say that Donald Trump is president. Oh yeah, boy, I love cutting trees. Turn my mind off, turn my saw on, and chop them trees down. So what do I think the weather conditions? Well, on a sunny day, it's lovely. Best job in the world. When it's windy, it's, it's okay. It depends if the wind is helping the trees come down or not. If the wind's in your favor, then it makes the job really easy. Um, I could tell you a story about Dan, a contractor from uh, West Wales who used to do some work for my dad in the 1987 storms. He, he, my dad caught wind that he was out working when Hurricane Charlie came through. So uh, he went up there looking for Dan and Dan was having a hell of a time just snipping these trees at the bottom, watching them fly over in the 100 mile an hour winds and told him that he had to get the hell out of there. And at this point in his life, he must have been about 55. Dan's about 82 now and he's uh, got a firewood business on the side of the road in a little village called Shannabulla. And he's a hell of a character, still going strong. So maybe the job has it occupational hazard but if you don't get hurt then you probably live for a very long time and be very healthy. How long have I been working on the saw? Um, I did my certificate, first certificate when I was 21 but I've been chopping down trees for yeah 10 years. <laughs> Yeah, so um, my business is a forestry business based in uh, Kilkenny Kalo and we specialise in um, continuous cover forestry, which is close to nature forestry, which focuses on other outcomes other than just timber production, although timber production is important, like uh, biodiversity, uh, water um, quality and uh, amenity values. And we work all over the southeast, uh, do a lot of estate management stuff, stuff like we're doing here today, cutting out exotic trees in um, the national park um, from native hardwood plantations or native hardwood regeneration and uh, we do first thinnings of um, hardwood plantations which have been fairly prolifically planted in the last 20 or so years. Yeah so at the moment we're working for the Parks and Wildlife Service in the Wicklow National Park and we're cutting out um, exotic softwood species that have self-seeded uh, in areas of um, I suppose areas that they, they want to just preserve native uh, hardwoods only so we're just kind of covering a lot of ground and we're cutting those trees out and uh, that'll make way for the natives to come up regenerate